Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how do you, how do you make a quick intro with Adobe After Effects. And it's a quick one, a quick tutorial. As long as you know what to do, you pretty much will get it like this. You can't see me, but you pretty much will get it quickly. So, open Adobe After Effects and click Command N and pre make sure to make it 10 seconds. So, press OK and now command y and this one you should you, you can choose any color you want right now i'm going to choose orange okay and call this one hold on let me let me choose yellow and call it ramp okay press okay and go to effect um generate ramp Okay, now make click the white one, white color, and change it to black, and click the black top one and change it to whatever color you want. In this case, yellow. So click the click the center button and the center the the center button on the top and make it in the middle and click the bottom center button and make it like all the way at the bottom now click line liner ramp and put it to radial ramp now you get this circling effect okay now you go to command y and the same color and call this one particle okay now what you're gonna do is go to effect simulation CC particle world. Okay now since people have since the one since this video you clicked is Adobe After Effects in the Mac. How do you make a quick tutorial? What I'm using is CS5. So you you go to grid grid and guides click grid off and now you don't have the thingy so now you go to physics put velocity zero oops zero and gravity zero okay now you go to particle and and click line and click shaded sphere okay now come Make the the birthmark and the death mark the same color, so be something like this. Okay. Play the video until you see some little balls. Drag the video like over here and extend the particle the CC particle. Okay. Um, after you're done with particle, go to producer and make this point five hundred and drag this until until it's like one point thirty one point uh, five thirty okay so Yeah, well, that'll be enough. Okay, now after you're done, if you want to make it 3D, which that's the whole point of this video, making like point point 100. Wait, hold on. Make about point 200 is fine. No point three hundred. Sorry, guys. Point three hundred and you you can adjust it. So, okay. After you're done, go to layer new camera and leave it the same, and go to layer new null object.
Null objects. Okay. Now click the swirly thing, drag it to null, and then click the last square, and it will make it 3D. Okay, now. Click text, and I'm going to make the text bigger and call it shift to tutorial okay you have to click the top right corner to adjust the the size that's what I do okay now after you're done uh, make the screen smaller and click text again and put it down there like somewhere around there and then this one I'm gonna call it and more stuff turn that are in some videos. Hold on, hold on. Make the text smaller and that are in some videos. Okay. After you're done, you you. You probably want to drag it up to make sure people can see it. So, right now I'm going to make it like this far. Okay. And make sure, make sure, and the two texts you have, make it 3D like the null object. Click the last square in both of them. Okay, now, click, click this button and click transform and um, click position and orientation so what oh oops make sure it's in the beginning of, beginning of your video so now click position orientation and click orientation the middle one and turn it until you can't see it so it's something, something like, let's make it 900, I mean 90. Okay, now it should probably be invisible. So now, after you've done that, go like in 20 seconds and uh, turn it the way you want it. Okay, after that, click add or remove keyframe at current time so which means position and now you have a square I mean rhombus in a position so skip after like after two seconds and now turn it until it's like that okay now click the positions rhombus again and before it hits three, go to position, hit the middle part of position, and drag it down until you see the second part of your text. Okay, so now um, make it until you like want it the same thing as the top. So. It's like up and up. Okay. So pass after like about in five seconds. About here. And then to end the video exactly at five seconds. Go to orientation, click the last one and drag it. Oops, that's another one. Go to position and click the last one and just drag it. Oh wait, uh, sorry. Remember to click the position rhombus. And now you could end your video. So at 5, drag it all the way down, and boom, you did it. It should look like this. <clears throat> so it's pretty. It's a it's a really fast interesting tutorial 
which is part of my video. So you could adjust it if you want. And that's all. Rate, comment, subscribe, like, and share my video. And I hope you use this in some of your videos if I get to see your videos. So thank you guys for watching.